What's up guys, The Hunted Reaper here, and today's uh, commentary is going to be about ranked play for Call of Duty World War II. Uh, this is a live video, so if I like go blank for a little bit or you know just pause, don't uh, don't give me shit. I'm trying to get like my first reactions to playing uh, ranked gameplay. So I hope you guys enjoy the video, give it a like, uh, subscribe, and hopefully I do well in this game. Uh, I'm not giving you guys any uh, bets because I'm not that great at Call of Duty. I have things that I'm good at, and I haven't really played it for a while. I've been focusing on other games, so I'm kind of rusty, but Ranked did just come out, and I really want to get a video out. So uh, hopefully the gods put it in my favor that I'm able to do well in Ranked. Uh... Welcome to Season 1! Let's see. Uh, play 10 placement matches to acquire your initial rating. Play ranked matches to increase your rating and progress through tiers. And play matches all the way through the season after your stats will rank and will reset. So it's basically like Rainbow Six Siege, uh, where uh, there's seasons and things reset. Some of your divisions are modifying restricted elements. Okay. So there are restricted elements. Cool. Let's see uh, what kind of new division slot unlocked. Okay, 15 slots. So I think you have everything unlocked in this mode. Yeah, everything is unlocked in this mode. That's pretty cool. Uh, so what I can do is just make a custom class, right? And I'll put the FG42 in that. Uh, I feel like I fucked up somewhere. Oh, you can't have certain different types of guns. Okay, uh, rapid fire. Okay, rapid fire and high caliber are both banned from ranked. Okay, that kind of sucks, because I do like high caliber for my headshots. Advanced rifling, though, is back, which is good. Uh, grip, let's see. I'm just making, I'm, what I'm doing right now is making like a, a kind of nice class for this gun, because I do want to have fun with it. And let's see, I'll do a reflex sight. Camouflage. Okay, so it kind of follows the custom games dynamic where uh, some of the things that are unlockable in the main multiplayer modes are not for use. Like some of the, the new gun mods and stuff like that aren't available for ranked. And that's that's okay. I, it's, not, it's all aesthetic, so it doesn't really matter. I'm kind of glad that they took out advanced rifling and shit like that because that would kind of suck. Uh, I'm not advanced rifling. I'm glad they took out um, rapid fire because that would kind of suck. People definitely do get ahead of themselves rapid fire. Let's see. Oh, wow. A lot of just basic trading has been taken out. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that, that, that is that is pretty crazy. So we, we lost Bang. We lost Concussed. Let's see what else we lost. Ordinance, Lookout, Rifleman, Instincts, Requisitions, Launched, Espionage. That's like half of the list. So let's see. Uh, let's see what else has been banned. Uh... Let's go to, oh wow, actual perks get banned too. So some perks are getting banned right here. Uh, this incendiary shotgun cells shells are banned. LMG bipond is banned and that's about it. So I don't think that's kind of fair though because so for some classes, you know, you have all the things and then for armored and expeditionary, there's no reason to use those classes. And those classes were used kind of less in the first place. So I don't know why they would shit on them even more. I don't, except for the incendiary shells, I don't think bipods should be not allowed. Uh, sharpshooter's pretty cool. What I think they should have done is taken out sniper sharpshooter, which allows, you know, pe people to see down the sights, and the always invisible, the recon enemy aircraft is pretty good too. So what I'm going to do is make one of these silent ass classes right here, right? And then let's see what we can do with that. Uh, let's use the MP40 because I never get to use it. Uh, I, I'll, I'll keep, I will keep regular sight on it, steady aim, and then let's give it a thick magazine. There we go. So, machine pistol, basic training should be, there we go. Okay, so I have my two classes, hopefully this kind of works out. I am going to use, okay, so another, another thing, uh, restricted in ranked play again. Looks like paratroopers, uh, care packages, and ooh, recon aircraft. Restricted. Now that's fucking weird. Okay, I mean, fun, I guess. So 
what I would assume is that suppressors are kind of king. So the mountain class would kind of not work out. So I'll use airborne for this. Throw a suppressor on my MP40 and uh, see how jiggy I get with that. And hopefully that all works out. Okay, so we're gonna go to a lobby, placement session, find rank game. Okay, so there's 10 placement matches. I guess this will be my first placement match and then when the game, you know, when I actually do 10 matches, I'll do another video, and that video will be, like, my my overall thoughts on the actual ranked gameplay, because this is, like, my first impressions. My, 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 after, after 10 placement matches, I'll definitely do an overall thoughts video. I do enjoy how they don't show the ranked of the matched players. I, uh, I think that's pretty cool. Uh, also, that is not the uniform I picked out, so maybe just random uniforms. Dossier. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Uh, I'm gonna change up my kill streaks a little bit because some of these are terrible. I'm gonna use a fighter pilot for the first one, glide bomb for the second one, and I'm not a big fan of artillery barrage, so I'm gonna go ahead and use. Ooh, this is a hard one. I'm gonna use the fire bombing run as my last one. I'm most likely not gonna get the fire bombing run, but uh, you know. Hopefully, fucking hopefully. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna run really quickly. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I'm back. I'll probably just edit that out where I probably already did because you know I'm that cool. So Gibraltar is my first map. Yeah, loading screen. It's always a weird time for a commentator when a loading screen is happening because then you're like, what the fuck do I do? Okay. Oh, glitches already. This is this is fun. So I uh, I'm notably I'm like infamously known to suck when I'm talking and playing the game at the same time. Ooh, we're playing Search and Destroy. Okay. So this is kind of like Rainbow Six uh, in a way. You know, Search and Destroy is a really uh, you know one life kill mode. So that's kind of like Rainbow Six. I'm gonna throw my suppressor on. See what we can do over there. I don't have sound running because I'm doing a live stream, so I don't want there to be two takes of audio. Uh. Or just just background noise, so I'm going kind of without audio. Ooh, okay. There seems to be them over there. So, oh, fuck me. Yep. I'm like the first one to fucking die in Search and Destroy. Like, because I'm not used to playing Call of Duty uh, like a Search and Destroy kind of game. I'm used to kind of playing it like... Like Call of Duty, you know, like you have infinite lives and it's just kill as many people as you can. I'm used to playing like Rainbow Six Siege and Battlefield more more conservative with lives just because of the fact that each live can be used a little bit better. But that's just a personal opinion. Uh, I still like the game. I still like Call of Duty. It's just, it's a different game for me. So like, if this is only Search and Destroy, I'm going to be kind of fucking pissed. Uh, okay, there we go. Let's see what we can do with this now. I'm just gonna run out of there and see if I can like nail the whole team down. This is probably terrible gameplay if I die though. Okay, boom, one down. Okay, there. I think this is. There we go. One down. You gonna get the most. You gonna get the most fun gameplay when you're playing Search and Destroy. It's either epic or like the most boring shit you can ever watch. That's the problem with Search and Destroy. So for my first match, I hope there's like different. I hope there's like team death match and shit like that. I hope it's just not just search and destroy because they could have just made another search and destroy playlist like rank search and destroy. Okay, they planted the fucking bomb. I'm, I can't even hear anything, but they planted it. I'm just gonna make sure no one. Oh, look at that. Okay, so it seems like most people are going without sights. Oh, that guy's going with sight. Okay, I mean, it, it feels like regular Call of Duty. Um, nothing's, nothing's completely different, which is okay. It's just that, like, I don't feel any differences yet in terms of gameplay. And I know I'm not supposed to instead of... Uh, because there's it's just ranked. It's, it's not anything new. But I kind of wanted there to be a difference. I'm not going to lie. 
like a different game mode or at least something like that you know with the budget that activision has they can make they can make a whole new game and still be in the fucking black like uh like just just the amount of money they spend on these games it should be it should have more modes in this or at least more maps they could have released released like another fucking map with ranked mode you know just to get people into the game again I'm the last man standing. Uh-oh. Fuck. It's always spooky when you're the last man standing. Okay, there's two of us last alive. That fucking sucks. Okay. That's, like, terrible. I hate that. That's, that's some pressure that I don't like on me. Okay. Grab the bomb. You got nerfed, motherfucker. Okay. So at least I didn't um, embarrass myself in front of YouTube. I hate fucking doing that. I do that all the time. Like, I'll be recording a live video, and then I'll trash the bed. Like, I, I will mess up so bad. So this is actually kind of fun for me. I got to actually kill a guy on a live video. That's pretty cool. Even though when it's uploaded, it's not really live anymore. But fuck it, why not? I guess the point of a live video is just to have a little more fun with it than, uh, than other videos. You get the, the raw reaction, even though it's a little less well edited. I kind of like editing my videos just a little bit more because all well, that shit. Let's see what else. Uh, what, what I'm really concerned about for ranked gameplay is the fact that, you know, there's going to be this new ranking system and how it places your player with other players should be a big thing. Uh oh, fuck. Sorry about that. My my uh, my brain stopped working when I was almost gonna die. Uh, so like, what what I'm really concerned about when it comes to ranked play is how they're gonna bunch up players because, you know, in a week everyone's gonna be going hard for this game. Everyone's gonna be wanting to be the next MLG top guy, have the best rank in Call of Duty, and tell their friends how fucking good they are. But the problem with that is is that Activision now has this responsibility to to properly match people up with other people. And let's say you're getting teams of people that are leaving, you know, things like, th a lot of the things that Rainbow Six Siege have uh, that's wrong with it, this game can possibly have, too. So it's kind of like, like, how are they not going to fuck it up is the whole thing. Hopefully they don't fuck it up. Like, right now it's just Search and Destroy for me, and I'm, not, I'm just playing a match of Search and Destroy, but I, I kind of hope that, you know, when the match ends, you get to see. I think we won four fucking rounds. Why are there more rounds? Intermit there's four rounds Four fucking rounds god damn it Like how, why 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 is why is two not good enough? So I'm gonna just slam the door outside Okay, I'm just gonna plant the bomb. I'm just gonna fucking plant the bomb Fuck it. Why not? You know no one seems to be going to the bomb I'm just gonna plant the fucking thing Okay. Oh, I almost fell off the fucking map. I'm like, I'm gonna jump over there. My dumb ass. I'm gonna go around because it seems like. Oh, yeah, I knew it. I fucking knew it. <coughs> I fucking fucking knew it. Am I the last alive? Motherfucker. Yeah, I guess I'm just with, like, a shit team. Because, like, I'm nailing them, planting the bomb, doing everything I need to do, and these fucking assholes are winning. Okay. That's, that's one thing I do hate about ranked gameplay. It's that it's just so fucking annoying when you have, like, a mediocre team. Like, especially when you're losing, and we're not losing at all, but, like, when you're losing and, like, you're, the, you're in first place carrying the team, it's like, okay, so I'm better, but you're punishing me as a video game for being with bad people so it gets to the point where it's like you know what what do i do to be better oh fuck okay what do i do to be better that's what i get for bad english right there i get fucking shot i get shot for bad english so like like you know you know what do you do to be better but what do you do in cases when the whole team sucks and you want your rank to go up but it can't because you're just place of people who suck that's why i guess people have clans and shit like that but I'm, I'm not I'm not a big clan guy like my schedule is not the best when it comes to clan shit 
Uh, you know, everyone has a different schedule. I go to college, shit's hard. You know, a lot of my time is spent, so I'm more of a solo play kind of guy. Or I'll go, um, you know, to a group and figure out who can fucking play with me. But I'm not really, I'm not really a clan guy. And I know one of my age kind of, ha- you know, it's either you're a clan guy or you just don't because you don't have the fucking time for it. And I just can't find the time for it. So that's why. Uh, I might not be playing ranked mode that much because it's kind of fucking boring. I'm, I know uh, people like Search and Destroy, but if I'm playing Search and Destroy with like less attachments, less camos, um, not able to use my unlocks, and it's just so I can get a nice little shiny pendant on my uh, emblem, I might just say like, fuck it, why not? Like, why not just do nothing? Okay, let's see where we are. Where the fuck did that come from? Why are they able to use kill streaks in search and destroy? Fucking beyond me. Fucking beyond me. That's bullshit. Okay. Yeah, you guys just got to see me be fucking pissed. How are you gonna. Ugh, god damn it. I, I know, like, you can have search kill streaks, but, like, I didn't even expect that shit. And especially in a game mode where there, there's one fucking life per fucking life. Why the fuck this guy's terrible? Um, when there's one fucking life per life, why are they allowing kill streaks? Like, I, I get if it was, like, ranked team deathmatch. Oh, he got the bronze star for heroic service? For killing one guy? Fuck him. Um, God, I'm getting so angry. Call of Duty Dead. Oh, victory. Wow. Who great. Okay. Score. So I guess you have to get the six. Six is the six is the number you need to win. A one more than five. That makes sense. My question is, is it all search and destroy? Because if it is, that sucks. Like, a lot. So hopefully it's not. If the loading screen took any longer, I could actually grow a beard. Okay. How am I not in first place? I want to see the scoreboard. What the fuck? Okay, what? Check. Thanks, not even a fucking win. I got to check. Okay. So, oh, first impressions. This is kind of hard. Like, they don't really give me many impressions to go by. It feels like this mode isn't that different from the game. And it's just like this kind of quirk. Not quirk. It, 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 it's like, how do I put this? The game's trying to make you guys come back. And it's not working. This whole ranked mode, this whole ranked uh, thing, just doesn't really feel fluid. It doesn't really feel at home for Call of Duty so far. Like, it just feels like Call of Duty and maybe you get an insignia at the end of it. But it doesn't feel like anything new or anything like that. It just feels like if Call of Duty was a kind of a little more fair, but still kind of shitty. And... I think Call of Duty should focus on, like, their war mode a lot more, because war mode is a lot of fun. Like, it's just a consistent amount of fun for me, and it's the most fun I've had in a Call of Duty game in a while. And so, like, things like this are just kind of a slap in the face, because this doesn't change the game at all. You know, Call of Duty isn't as competitive when it comes to ranked stuff like Rainbow Six Siege. And I think they're trying to be Rainbow Six Siege right now, and... Rainbow Six Siege has, like, character, and, and, and you know, every life kind of matters. But in Call of Duty, where every life never really fucking matters, I don't feel like there should be a ranked game mode that treats it as such. Uh, so, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to be having a lot more on Call of Duty. But I hope you guys, uh, I hope you guys do know that this, this video was, like, a live commentary. So, if I sucked, it's just because I suck. <laughs> um... So subscribe, comment. Uh, there's going to be another video posted about a week from now uh, talking about you know ranked play in general. I might post it today. Who fucking knows? As soon as I get to the 10 matches, though, I will post another video uh, on my review on ranked mode. But these are my first impressions. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And subscribe. I feel like I said that a thousand times. This has been The Hunted Reaper.